What was the most surprising thing about Tetsuya Nomura? And if you met him again, what would you tell the daddy of yourself? <laughs> I suppose the most surprising thing about Nomura that I came to realize was kind of just how shy he is. Um, it's an apparent thing that he's quite a shy dude, and I didn't really expect that, being in the position that he's in. But if I think about it, he was an art designer, so going from art designer straight into directing, that's a pretty big scene, and then becoming like... Uh, if you find it massively famous in the video game industry it, just that like that, it's a big change. So I think, yeah, just kind of how shy he is, lasers. that was probably the most um, surprising thing for me personally. I'm not saying like when I met him though, he was like, sort of like, oh fuck, don't look at me, like we can't make direct eye contact anxiety or something like that, like it, it wasn't anything like that. Um, but it was very apparent that he was he was quite shy. Though, that being said, uh, he was the one that like waved me down the second time meeting him. So in that regard, I don't know maybe if he felt like comfortable around me, but he, he waved me down when he was with this group of people. And then like kind of almost hailed me over. So like I went over with a viewer of mine, which I'm so happy again. I said, I've explained this story before, but to reiterate, I had a viewer of mine with me. This was at E3. Um, and so he was able to actually meet Tetsuya Nomura, and I, I was so happy about that. Um, also, like, he knows no English, like, basically no English, so, like, talking to him is, it's extremely hard, uh, because, of course, you've got to go through a translator, so he's always got, like, a translator with him whenever he is overseas, or at least in the English-speaking countries. So to have an actual conversation with him is a little bit hard. The thing that I really regret the most was not being prepared to ask him questions on the two times that I was able to meet him. I think, like, I said thank you so much both times or whatever for, like, the amazing work you've been doing. Um, at E3, I was talking more so about, like, Pirates from Frozen because that was when we got the Pirates and uh, Frozen trailer and I was like, you know, great job and stuff. I, I love the new aesthetic of, like, the Pirates world. But, like, I, I didn't ask him any questions and I think that's the thing that I will do differently next time is, like, okay, I'll have some questions there for him, and I'll actually, uh, like, if I ever get the chance again, I don't know if I will, but, um, yeah, I, I think I'll ask, I'll actually ask him some questions, because I've explained the story before, but when I met him for the first time at the premiere event, I was talking about fucking cats. I was talking about cats to him, and how, like, it was the most embarrassing thing, and so that's why I was so surprised when, um, he called, like, he hailed me, uh, the second time around, the next month after, during E3, because I thought I made a complete fucking fool of myself. I was like, yeah, so, because then interview had come out, like, a week beforehand, talking about how, um, Nomura has this love for cats, and he was talking about, like, he's, he's big on cats, right? So I was like, oh, God, um, I, I, uh, I'm, like, stumbling, I'm, like, trembling. I was just like, yeah, so I hear you like cats, um, so do I. Like, I've got a cat as well. Uh, it's, it's a long-haired tabby. Um, he's like, yeah, yeah, ooh. You know, he's being polite. He was like, oh, yeah, love cat, love cats, love cats, love cats, or whatever. And I'm like, oh, my God. Like, this, this is the most fucking, this is, this is the most embarrassing. This is, oh, my God. Like, I, I cracked, dude. I cracked. I cracked. Absolutely cracked. Absolutely cracked. I could have had, like, the prime opportunity two times to do like a small little interview type thing to get some juicy questions and answers you know but no for, I was like cats um I hear you like cats yo that's that's sick dude the second time around I didn't really have much time because he was like in a rush he was going off to somewhere like in E3 and all that and I was just basically saying like hey good to see you again like are you enjoying your time uh, you know, doing a lot of travel at the moment. I can imagine it's probably a busy period for you and all that. But the first time was just terrible. It was terrible. It was it was god awful. It was great the fact of me being able to meet him and talk to him, and the book thing he gave me or whatever. But like, what I said was so it was so embarrassing. I was so embarrassed. I was so embarrassed.